Yo, what's up, YouTube? I'm back again with another video. Uh, this time, guys, I'm going to show you how to paint your rims with just general purpose paint. That's what I'm using anyway. But it's probably better if you use car paint. But, you know, if you just want to make them look better, you know, this is the best way to go. Save money. Just regular general purpose paint like this come from Walmart. And uh, that's what I put on them, you know. Anyway, guys, let's get started. First thing you do, get you some cleaner. This old, old glass surface cleaner right here. Kind of spray them down. Make sure you get all that dirt and stuff off of them before you paint them. Wipe it. First thing you do. I don't want no grime or nothing on them because the paint won't stick to them too good. Especially when them look pretty smooth, you know. Now they ain't got to be perfect. But this is what I paint mine with. Just general purpose paint that comes from Walmart. It served me pretty good. It doesn't come off too much either. Over a period of time, it may dull down a little bit. But uh, other than that, that's about all it does. This stays there. It's a good idea. You can sand them a little bit. Like some thousand grit. Something just to make them, you know, slick. Make sure there ain't no rough, no grit or nothing on them. Which I don't really care about that. Okay, see so how I've done that. Got it all nice and clean. You can't apply a second, you know, come out and do it a second time like this. That really make sure everything off of them for your paint. You know, when you're going with black, you know, it don't even matter too much. Just spray away. Any dirt, grit, and grime, anything up there, kind of saturate it good. Let it kind of wash us down the tire like that. Just like that, guys. Let it wash us down. Come behind just a regular rag. Wipe again. Re repeat the same process. You definitely want to make sure you ain't no trash on them too much. Got to get in there good. Make sure ain't no trash or nothing on them uh, rims because they're going to show right back up in your paint job when you paint it. You're going to see that trash again. You want to wipe any lint free or lint dust, you know. Good idea to let them air dry too for a few seconds. Like that, you can see some of the dirt and haze come off there. Try to clean as you're looking. Just keep wiping, wiping, and wiping away. Be a good idea to have a tack cloth, but I ain't got one. Tack cloth, go get all the lint and everything off. But it's just a rim. They're gonna get uh, nicks and picks in it anyway from the highway. So they ain't really got to be perfect, perfect. Cause the roads ain't perfect. <laughs> so let's try it here. Okay. Just keep it wiping for a second wipe. Just like this. Just like this. White, white, white. Okay. 
guys is all good enough, prepped out just for the paint. Now, this is a little cheap job. This is a general purpose paint from Walmart. It's for interior and exterior use. Shake it up real good. Just give it a good shake, make sure everything's drying up lovely. Shake it up just like this, guys. Gotta shake it pretty good. It's important how the paint turns out. That's how it be in my opinion. Okay. Let's pop the top. Okay guys, let's go apply in the paint. Let's put on a coat. Okay. Let that dry anywhere from a minute to three minutes. Just keep shaking it up like. But guys, you could just keep shaking it throughout the whole thing if you choose to. That's something I choose to do. Alright. Doesn't take more long for this paint to dry. Let's hit it again. Like I said guys, it's just a cheap way out A pain, the rims or something, a truck or car. Just want to try to make them look better. Let that dry up. So sad. As you can see guys, it look pretty good already. Check it out. Let that dry out for a minute or two. You could tell from the other rim right there. Compared to this. Let's take a look at that guys. See that rim? Compared to that rim. I just painted. Looks a whole lot better already. See that from here. See how bad it needed. Sir, and like I said, it doesn't take long for this to dry. Pretty much, you can go ahead on and hit it time after time. Doesn't take long. Okay, let's go and wet it down a little bit. I ain't putting too many coats on. I think the less you put on, the better it'll stay. All right, here we go.
I'll be honest with you, that's about enough on it right there. Just let that dry up. And uh, that's about good enough for me, man, right there. It's good enough. That's all the paint you really need to put up there. You know, get it too thick, it might start to chip and stuff like that. You want to kind of keep it thin and smooth as possible, you know. That's how you paint a rim, the cheap way, you know. Just for general purpose paint. Just want to make them look better like this right here, like I did. It's the way to go. All right. So, guys, I'm going to let this dry up. I'm going to let you guys go. Hope you enjoyed. For those of you new to my channel, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. I want to thank all my viewers and my subscribers for watching my videos. And, guys, you got any comments about this little paint job for your rims, just comment down below. And I hope this helps somebody want to save money the Walmart cheap way. Just make sure everything wiped down clean. And just apply a spray to it. It stays up there because I've done it, used this a lot before. Alright. So guys, take care. And I'll see y'all on the next video. Peace out, YouTube. Go paint some wheels, man.